our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Stefan Skyscraper! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Alexander the Great Boganowski! Ready to fight? Ready? Good. All right, here we go. Early round action with the UFC featherweight champion Alexander Volkanovsky. And when you want to talk about mixed martial arts evolution, perhaps no man has improved as much over the last two or three years than the featherweight king Alexander Volkanovsky. Oh! His opponent in a lot of trouble now. That was Chris Velasquez's punch of choice. to these there. Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his length well yet again. Drew gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Back in the clinch, look for a now. Very good at changing levels when he can get to this clinch position and get it close. Well, why fix what's not broken? Why not go right back to that overhand here again? And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Ooh, that uppercut landed for him. Take down defense is there. Man, his jab is good. There it is. Oh, nice left hook there from Volkanovski. Volkanovski is such a phenomenal fighter. I believe his confidence is what truly carries him to be so spectacular, to be so successful. He believes with every part of himself that he is the absolute best fighter in the world. Oh, that was beautiful. Two minutes here to go in round one. And there's a takedown attempt. Jeez, you can hear that. <laughs> Doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Nice uppercut inside. Oh, and another punch by Volko. Oh, nice kick. Oh, guillotine, guillotine here. That guillotine is tight. Oh, submission defense on full display there. He said that he was very aware of what this guy brought to the octagon and the show in that defense. Might be a submission attempt here, Chad. I mean, you cannot sit in the full guard. When you sit in the full guard, you give these guys so many opportunities. Oh, it looks like he's trying to isolate an arm here. Triangle now, DC. We'll see if he can close the show. Oh, the triangle is in. And now the attacking arm guard. Oh, he got it. Oh, this guy is so aware. He never leaves anything long to allow for himself to get subbed. Well, Panofsky's in half guard now. Posture's up now and lands a vicious head strike. Round two is next. We now take a look back at some of the highlights from that last round, DC. A lot for the replay guys to choose from. I mean, these guys are going to be very busy trying to find what replay to show you guys. Lands on both sides of the octagon. Both guys fought great. What a phenomenal round. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, round two. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Lands a solid kick right there. Well, Alexander Volkanovsky has never lost a pro fight at 145 pounds, and if his boxing is any indicator, the big changes levels now, DC. Oh, man. Dars, yep, he's trying to hit the Dars here. Oh, that's very deep now. Great submission defense, full display by the opponent. And it looks 
looks as though he'll let his opponent stand up here. Yes, he will. All right, so he's landed a few semi uppercuts already, DC. Got to think he goes back to it. I am almost certain he's going to go and try to find another one of those. But expect him to really sit down and try to make one really count and try to end this fight. Just over three minutes now to go in round two. He loaded up there on that high kick. Oh, Volkanovski's got a big bruise starting to form on the right side of his body. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. Oh, straight connection right up the gut, DC. He's in a world of trouble now. They say his great moves are the ones that get there first, and it got right to the target. And back to his feet. Well, he rocked him, but couldn't finish him. He rocked him. He hurt him bad. He could find that one shot to close the door. Could not shut the lights off. And now he's past from trying to find that shot again. Great upper body movement defensively. Slips another strike there. And offensively, he hasn't been a wool beater, but defensively, he's been strong. Too. And that has to cause frustration. <laughs> starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Oh, big knee there. Tries to take out the leg. Beautiful leg kick lands. 20 seconds left to go in round two. All right, let's go. Let's get those hands going now. Final seconds of the round. Beautiful job getting those hands up. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, there's the end of the round, and what a five minutes it was for him. Rocked and stunned his opponent multiple times, and I don't know, did his opponent just say uncle on the stool, or is he going to fight on? I mean, he may say uncle. When you're getting beat and battered and bruised like that, it's a testament to your toughness. But it's not ideal. You want to be competitive. That round was not competitive at all. All right, so there's the end of the round. A lot of high-level action. And if you like the takedown game, as my boy Daniel Cormier. You ready to fight? You ready? Let's Third go. round underway. Just misses with that one. Good shot, good shot. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Well, just as he did in the previous round, a big quick level change. Oh, he see. went single, rotated head outside this dude ball for a ride. Nicely done. Now drops inside that closed guard, DC. Full guard. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or pick round and round. Nice strike from the bottom fighter there. Oh, gotta be careful there, yeah. Ooh, good movement to avoid that strike from the top. All right, he's been very clean with his hooks on the feet here tonight, and it's the way he set it up that has really... Oh, he's hurt. He's wobbling. Oh, nice level team. North-south position now. Fighter trying to pass here, Ooh, but gets denied. Gets denied. Great job, great recognition of seeing what your opponent was trying to do. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. Just over two minutes to go in our third and final round. All right, looks like he's got a couple hooks in here, DC, and defensively, you better be careful. Oh, right into Mo. And now, I think he's looking for a submission. 
He's going to start to chase the arm triangle. The arm triangle is getting very close. What he's got to do now is get to the opposite side of the body. He's got to get his body on the side of the lock and get the finish. The sheer will is, is really remarkable to watch. Somehow he gets out. Fantastic submission, Dean. Strong's able to flatten him out. This could be real trouble now. All right, so now blood is a factor. You see that he has been opened up in that eye area. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye, and now there's a cut. But it's nothing to worry about too much now. But he's got to be very careful with it as we go forward. Oh, submission attempt here. He's fighting. He wants his badly. Oh, this could be it. That thing is tight. That is tight. Oh, somehow, somehow he got out. These guys are back and forth, but the submission defense wins this transition. Stop, stop, stop.